My name is Emiko Sugiyama. I'm a producer of Juice Hip Hop Dance Festival and also co-artistic director. And I'm actually performing in Antics performance. When I visited Hiroshima, Japan, I met hip hop dancers and regular people in Hiroshima. I visited museums, uh, dorms, peace monuments, everything, and made me think that how human can become so, like from nothing to absolutely the reg regular life that we live in today, that fascinated me and made me think like, okay, I wanna do something with my artistic creativity. So I talked to the owner of Studio Flex, his name is Taka, about my festival, and he said he would love to uh, send Japanese people to participate the festival. So I said, okay, let's do the World Peace Theme this next year and let's make it happen. My performance is actually, it's not my work. It's an antics performance piece and I am one of the dancers uh, in, in their show and this is about the fighting, about fighting against myself, fighting the society. It's about all directions you can take and uh, myself I pick as a samurai woman <laughs> fighting against society and fighting against myself and I'm a b-girl so I'm gonna be expressing myself through breaking most
Okay, my name is uh, Bionic, and I'm with my crewmates, Kid Boogie and Slim Boogie. We represent uh, Machine Gun Funk, uh, straight from the Bay to LA. Uh, we specialize in uh, popping, boogaloo, uh, waving animation, uh, most of those styles under that uh, popping umbrella. Initially, uh, Kid Boogie was supposed to represent, and then luckily me and uh, Slim Boogie were in town, so we wanted to make a group effort and perform for the show. And we know that Juice is like a big, thing here in LA and we wanted to represent our group since you know a lot of us are here now. The theme is of course world peace and we wanted to kind of uh, just show like you know make sure people realize that dance is bigger than us and uh, the thing that we did we did this little story is like we were brought from like we're like the called the funk lords and uh, we're bringing back like you know that essence back into the dance so the dance that's kind of clouded you know what I mean from all the you know like how would you say it? like just all the negative energy we just want to put back just the raw essence of the dance back into you know back into the planet that's that was our uh, theme for the um, show i think you know for for example like anything with dancing uh any art that you have expression and being able to express that through through our arts is a big you know like a big deal we always want to try to like you know that's a good thing because it kind of unifies a lot of people and we're able to create and build these shows in representation of like whatever is going on in the world. You know what I mean? And we can we can artistically do it. You know, and, and if we can do it, we're gonna represent it the best way we can. You know what I mean? Hopefully, maybe next year some people uh, that are missing it this year can catch it. But for the people coming in this year, we just want to thank you. And it's 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 always a great thing to catch uh, people perform and represent. You know what I mean? That energy that the crowd gives to the performers and the performers gives to the crowd. It's a good reciprocation. So we're just glad to be able to be a part of it. Uh, same thing, thank you to the people that came and to the people that couldn't come. Hopefully next year you, got, you guys can come and see us. And uh, to all my people and my, and my family in Japan, I love you guys. Yeah, same. Uh, God bless and, and thank you guys for supporting the dance and just being able to check us out. And, uh, you know, my family and friends and everyone that supported our group. Thank you. God bless. Peace. One night. The Funk Lords sent three lords to bring the soul back to the earth, the beat back to the planet. You are going to be saved. You are going to be saved.
Just keep it guessing. Yes, guess is greater than anybody. It's greater than the Boogaloo. It's greater than Fat Fun. It's greater than any other pop and rock in the house, whatever. The dance is first. The dance will outlast everybody. Just keep it down. The dance will go on. Ladies, I stay strong. To the G. piece we're doing tonight is going to be about with uh, a lot of hip-hop locking, breaking, crumping, trying to mix everything together and make it into a dynamite piece. The theme for this year is uh, for Juice is world peace and um, we, were, we were thinking really hard in the group like what, what kind of stuff should we do and we end up doing, thinking about doing like a villains against villains. And in the end, we um, try to make all the villains get united. And I believe that ends up as a world piece. Um, I got into this uh, event Juice from, um, we done it two years ago. And um, my boss, Sarah Smalls, uh, she got a email from um, Amy Catfox from email. and. We decided to do it again this year. Dancing is really, it's a release. And also it just simply keep me out of trouble. And when I was in middle school, I had like, I, did, I wasn't doing anything except for basketball. But I decided to do something with my life and I started going to dance school. So many hours, in one, so many classes. And I got up into my level being able to perform at Juice. I personally uh, want to, I'm doing it for um, the March 11th 
people from in Japan, not only from Japanese American, not only Japanese American, but people in Japan too. And um, I really want to just do something positive. And if they watch us, if they see us somewhere, and if they get some kind of energy, then that's exact, that's what I asked for.
in their world. They duel for power with a passion. Who will win this war of the world? Some Louboutin slippers. Oh, Picasso was alive, he would have made her. That's right, he was born, at least I can't 